Well, hello, Space Dronauts. Welcome to the Launchpad, and LEGO Fortnite is here, and it is amazing, and I have not been able to play since it came out this week because I have had a lot of work. But I'm really looking forward to getting into it. But first, I wanted to see what got LEGO-fied and what did not in my locker. I got this awesome LEGO music track playing in the background, which is pretty cool. They gave it to us for free, just just for, I guess, just for playing the game. So um, but let's check this out. Let's see what we got uh, that can be a Lego item and what is not in our locker. So first things first, very clearly, my Dark Vanguard astronaut is uh, is an official Lego character. I think that's pretty great that they managed to do it, although I would have hoped that her helmet was a little more than just this matte black all the way around. I mean, because her helmet has some uh, orange on it, too. But you can see that she has her orange and her, her purple lights and everything on. I like it. I like it a lot. But let's see what else we have. Okay, let's start at the top. Because I heard that not everything got... Uh, not, not every skin received the Lego outfit. So starting from the top, we have Polar Peely. That's one cool banana. Oh, he looks adorable. Check him out. Can I spin him around? Let's see. Spin him around. He looks great. Blaze. Yeah. Very Renegade Raider-y look. Tectonic Complex. Now, she was like a magma fire person. She doesn't look very fiery here. But that's pretty cool. This is interesting because these are collab skins, the Marvel skins, but they all seem to be in Lego form. So here's Ant-Man and the Incredible Hulk, monstrous alter ego of Dr. Bruce Banner. And then you have Dark Phoenix. She's on fire. I really like Captain Marvel. She looks great. I actually have a Lego set, actually a couple of Lego sets with her in this costume. So that's pretty great. Higher, further, faster. And then Captain America as Sam or Sam Wilson as Captain America. That's pretty great from his TV show. And then Bright Star Bomber. I think she's in the, the trailers and stuff. Actually, no, this is the Captain America version of of um, of Bright Bomber. So she's one of the island's mighty heroes. And here is the OG Black Widow. Very excited to have been able to get her during season OG. Spider-Man Zero. He looks really cool. Look at the spider on his back. Awesome. Taskmaster. Yeah, again, pretty cool. I'm, su again, surprised Wolverine Zero. Surprised at all these Marvel skins. This says that it is Monarch, but it has a little, a little hammer and wrench on it. A higher detailed Lego style will be added later. Oh, oh, so that's the same. It says the same thing for Tectonic. So maybe they're going to like make them a better design later on. Here's Ruby. Very simple. She's black and white. And Ripley versus Sludge. I wonder if they're going to make these, make him look translucent like his actual character in the game. Star Wars? Yeah, because they have all those Lego Star Wars games. Maybe it's the same from Marvel because they have all the Lego Marvel games. But we got Han Solo and Fennec Shand from, um, from the TV shows. Oh, here's Darth Maul. He looks awesome. I don't even have a Darth Maul real Lego minifigure. Look at that. He's ready to fight Obi-Wan and his master, the Coruscant Guard. A clone trooper. Ahsoka's clone trooper. This is nice. Wow. I like the detailing a lot. I mean, it really it really looks like it's, a, it's from the Lego sets. And there's your regular stormtrooper. Oh, Kylo Ren. He's going to finish what Darth Vader started. Nice. From the First Order. Le uh, Princess Leia. And Luke Skywalker. Obi-Wan Kenobi. And Rey. Nice. I thought I had Finn. Hmm. I guess... I guess... I guess I don't have Finn. Or maybe Finn isn't a uh, Lego fight yet here. But we also have a Sith Trooper. Oh, that's nice. Look at that. Great. And a wolf pack trooper. And Allie. Who are you calling the stray? I think this was a Fortnite crew pack skin. And then, of course, our dark, dark vanguard. I never noticed that she has a moon on the front. A little patch of a moon on the front there. Right there. On her chest. And then there's like a skull patch. I'll have to look at the real skin and see what that looks like. 
We got Era, she's the Battle Pass skin. And Eternal Knight, another one. Now this is Joey. Joey has a transformation emote, so I wonder if they're going to add those to the game or not. We'll have to try that one day. Gear Specialist Maya, my uh, unique skin that I made during one of the Chapter 2 seasons. Oh, look at Galaxy Scout. Oh, she looks amazing. She's got the stars all over her. Discover the victory in the stars. Of course, they can't make a... They can't make the little stars that go around her head. And then Galaxia. This is the first the first crew pack skin, right? Very similar to Galaxy Scout. Now Fusion. Fusion doesn't look very Fusion-y. From Chapter 2 Season 1. He was the Tier 100 skin. Fade. Another Battle Pass skin. Then Kato Thorn. Here's another transformation. When can he transfer? Wow, where, where is he? He's like a... He's not there yet. Let's, let's see if we can get him back. There he is. He looks good, though, by himself, even if he's not the final version. Chimera, another alien one. They're probably going to fix his head. Maybe they'll make him more, look more Chimera-y. Malak, hey, look at that. I like this one a lot. It looks, it looks really nice, although he doesn't have any sword kind of iconography, like from his actual skin. Mecha Cuddle Master. Now, this isn't very Cuddle Mastery. You don't have her like her like teddy bear face or anything like that. But it's, it says snuggle through space and time. But they're going to fix it. And Menace. Menace looks like a little kid. <laughs> Put your shirt on, Menace. Actually, I think I think Raz has to do the same thing. You know, they, they look very simple. Hero Midas. Midas looks awesome. Look at his hands. They're all gold. He's got his gold tattoos. He looks good. I saw him in the trailer and in the, the Big Bang experience. Renzo, the Destroyer, again, very simple. They might add some animations to him. Raz from Chapter 2. He doesn't look very evilly. And then Paradigm. This does not look Paradigm-y at all. Not at all. She doesn't look like she's one of the seven. They're probably going to give her a helmet, I bet you, anything, when they fix it. Omega Rock looks adorable. Doesn't look very tough at all, or Viking-ish. But I like the colors. Nizumi, too, I like this color. It's a nice blue. That hairpiece is really cool too. Does it does it go all the way around? Yeah, look at that. Look at it, it goes right off of the shoulder. I wonder if that's a real Lego piece. Miz and then Mizuki. The depth of the ocean. So they're gonna they're gonna update these ones too. Then we have Ronin. Oh, I love the printing on his on his uh his chest and his arms. And look his hair is like all shaved on the sides. That's cool. Rose team leader, this is from the Save the World. Uh, pre-buy from my founders pack. That's pretty nice and simple. She's got her she's got her sergeant stripes right on the side. Nice. Snap. This is that that weird snap together one. They're gonna he he has a weird face and body look, so they're gonna obviously fix fix that later on. Very customizable. Serana from chapter two, season one. You can get extra styles from her. I remember from that season. Spectra Knight. Now, Spectra Knight's from the la the OG Battle Pass, and she's super customizable too. But it looks like this is all we're gonna get for for her, this version of her. Still pretty good. And the Spire Assassin, th she looks pretty spacey. Oh, she's happy too. Nice. Who else do we got? We have uh, Twin. Twin is another transformation where he he th they transform between different genders. I think. Uh, where'd you go? Come back. And then Torin from the sideways fair. She, she doesn't look as evil as she was in the game. But here's the origin, another one of the seven. He looks pretty good. Looks very, very game accurate. The imagined, also very accurate. Pretty neat. Nice. The cube queen, hmm, not very fearsome, but they're gonna fix her. I wonder if they're gonna fix her face printing and her body art. The ageless. Now, I thought he had, like, some white in his hair. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, there's Vi. I think Vi was another another uh, crew pack skin. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below. War paint. I don't even remember getting that skin. 8-Ball versus Scratch. Hmm. From Chapter 2, Season 1, he was the ninja. Looks very less ninja-y here, so I guess they're going to fix it. Adira? Yeah, she looks good. 
Aftermath? Another good one? I like the gold faces in these. Here's Agent Jones. Look at him. Looking all rugged. Chapter 2, Season 6. Going on, getting all the, the bounty hunters. Breezebel? Another crew pack? Aida? She looks like a bumblebee. Yeah. Pretty nice. Whoa, what's going on with her... her her uh, uh, description there. I guess this was a level up quest pack. Axie and Sentinel was another level up quest pack, it looks like. Astria. Now, this was like one of the, the recent crew packs, and she was a really spacey one, but it doesn't really come across here, so I guess that's why they're going to fix it. And then we have Antonia from the recent Battle Pass. Chapter 4, Season 4. Agent Peely. Of course they're going to fix this because, man, this should look like Peely. He should be a banana, right? What do we have here? Brutus. Brutus, they have to fix this. He does not look Brutish, Brutish, ish, Brutus, Brutish, Brutus, ish at all. Bites? Yeah, pretty good. Cameo versus Sheik. Again, I wonder if they're going to give them extra styles. Captain Hypatia. I got another spacey one, I think. Chaos Origins. Now, he's supposed to be all goopy, and he is clearly not goopy. So, we're going to have to see what goes on there. And there's Charlotte. This is a good skin. This is good. So, I think Charlotte had a, a, re like, like a real gothy vibe to her, and I think that comes through. Here's Demos. He was a crew pack skin. He doesn't look as devilly, devilish as he does in the actual game. Dahlia. She looks pretty good. Self-made. Self-perfected. This cube assassin is really nice. Look at that face. Look at that. That's gorgeous. I love this one. I think this is one of my my favorite of the crossovers so far. You got the printing all over with the cube runes. A noble, unstoppable. Yes, 10 out of 10. 10, 10, 10 out of 10. Love it. The Corrupted Voyager. Now, see, this is one of my, like, Vanguard alternates, and she's not an astronaut. Where's her space helmet? Where's her creepy, squiddy, computery, glitchy look? She doesn't look like an astronaut at all. This is this is the three. You get a three. Maybe they're gonna fix it. Oh yes, they're gonna fix it. Okay, they're gonna fix it. Good, because this you you need to be an astronaut. Okay, so I so I got that skin. Cluck, Cluck is you're, you're supposed to be a chicken. So I guess they're gonna. I didn't know Cluck was a girl. Did, did you? Did you know that Cluck was a girl? I did not know that. Nice. But they're going to they're gonna make Cluck look more chickeny, I guess, in the future. Then we have Chip Challenger. Pass, run, pass, and run. I guess that was the soccer skin that I bought. I think that's the really... The really uh, yeah, let them know. That was the really customizable one. At another astronaut, Dio. Uh, brother or compatriot of Siona. I think really nice, really nice. You don't get that he's an astronaut, though, with this design. So his, he just looks like he's wearing armor. Who is this? This is Dr. Sloan. Redacted. All right. First Dr. Sloan skin. They're going to upgrade her, obviously. Maybe make her more game accurate. Then we have Draken Steel Hybrid. Now, he's a monster, kind of lizardy, and he is from uh, a recent crew pack. So clearly some upgrades needed there. Dusty. Hmm. Two-time root ball MVP. She does not look very dusty-ish. But I guess you in the in the game she's like all super high techy and has her arms in like a, a binded thing and has robot arms. So Arisa, a lost princess. Evie looks pretty good. Very simple skin for Evie. Very simple print. Saw her in the trailer. Uh, saw her in the Big Bang event. Grizz. Now, Grizz is like a, a bear driving, like a, being carried by a mech suit kind of thing. Uh, and you don't get that here, so clearly got to fix that. And Guildheart. Golden Stag. Galaxy Crossfade. Now, see this? This actually, I thought I had more, it had more Galaxy stuff on it. And it clearly does not seem to, because I think in the game it looks super Galaxy-ish. And here, not so much. Also, I think they wear a cat face fish thick doesn't look like a fish no what happened where's your fish where where where's your fish 
Where's your fish stick? Wait, 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 wait. They could give Fabio Sparkle Mane his horse face and animation and everything, but they couldn't give Fish Thick his fish face? Or that Peely? Agent Peely? Hmm. And then, of course, here's the Lego, the free Lego skin Explorer Emily that you can get with your Lego Insider set. This is a solid skin. Look at the printing on the side. She's got like a, like some cuffs on her wrists. Nice. Very good. I haven't even seen this actual skin. We're not even halfway through. Gumbo. Gunner. Harlow. Nice. Haven. This is a good skin. Helsey. Does, you don't look very vampire hunter-y in this one. Uh-oh, what happened? Highwire. Kiara KO. Jules. Jules. How, well, look at... Where's, where's her tattoos? And it doesn't say they're going to fix her. You're Midas' daughter. Where are your tattoos? Joni the Red. Another vampire hunter. J.B. Chapansky, you are a chimp. You are a space astronaut chimp. And don't let them tell you any different. Where's your chimp face? Hmm? Come on. You're not a human. But they're going to fix him. Then, of course, you've got Imani. And Hope. Hope looks really nice. This is from the current season. This is really nice. Look at that little cat print That's on her hat. That's great. Then you have Kit. Now, you're a baby cat. Kit, you're a cat. And they didn't make you a cat? I guess they're going to fix it. But, man, you should have a cat face. Let's see if they have a Meowsles. If they have a Meowsles and no kit face, we're going to have words. Condor, looking pretty creepy. Core, Lennox Rose. Lexa. Lil Split, Lil Split. Come on, you're an ice cream banana split sundae. Come on, come on, Lego Fortnite. Looks like that's coming, though. Then we got May and Lieutenant John Llama. Now, see, they, 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 they did not make him a llama head, but they made that other guy the unicorn head. So, hmm, I don't know. But I do like Lieutenant Evergreen. This is pretty cute. For Christmas, pretty nice. You could be a tree in Lego Fortnite. Loveless. Lorenzo. Lom, yom, Lombro. I think he's supposed to have a llama face, too. They said they're going to fix it. Man cake is supposed to be pancakes. Where are your pancakes? Where are your pancakes? Hmm. Mariposa. Masai. Maeve. Mecha Strike Commander. Mecha Strike Defender. Omega Knight. Ocean. Nolan Chance. He looks pretty clean. Mystica. Hmm. Okay, look, here's Meowsles. Meowsles has a cat face. How come Kit doesn't have a cat face? Seriously? Meowsles. And then Meow Skulls! Oh my gosh! Your sister! Me Meow Skulls, they did you wrong. Because your brother, your brother has the cat face, but Meow Skulls, you don't even have your hoodie with your print and your skulls. Sheesh. That's going to be fixed. Phaedra... Phantasm, Piper Pace, where's your pizza box? There's no pizza. Prince Orin, Princess Lexa, you got Paradise Meowsles, where is your cat head? Oh no! Rift Knight Kieran, Rian, Renegade Lynx, you need to get fixed because you should have some cat stuff on you and you have no cat stuff on you. I'm sure they're going to fix that. Where's your tail? Where is your tail? They're going to they're going to they're going to fix that. It's got the got the little thing on it. Relic. Reese. Red Claw. I don't I don't remember Red Claw from chapter 3 season 4. Sabina. Sayara. Scuba Jonesy needs to be fixed to look more scuba-y. Celine and maybe more Jonesy-ish. Selene is supposed to be moony. She has a like moon theme. Not so much here, though. I guess that's okay. Shanta. Shimmer Dusk. Shimmer Dusk is nice. Needs more shimmery things. Southpaw. Southpaw is the one I'm thinking of that has the robot arms. 
Snowman, though. He has a he has a snowman face. That's pretty cool. Nice. I love it. I like this Dr. Sloan. Clearly they're gonna they're gonna fix it so that she's a little bit more in line with the other Dr. Sloan. But it's a nice outfit. Little bit of a stormtrooper vibe. But look at Sky. Wow. Sky is amazing. Look at the detail on her jacket and her shirt and her hoodie. Nice. That's really awesome. Really, really nice. Look at the hat. That's great. She was also in the Big Bang event. Here's Sayona. Sayona looks more astronauty than Dio. But still could use some more detail, I think. From Chapter 2, Season 3. Sierra. Stormfarer. Stray. Styx. Needs more detail. Summer Sky. Now, Summer Sky looks less skyish than actual sky. Look at the difference between this sky and this sky. This sky and this sky. I mean, they're supposed to be the same, but one of these things is not like the other. A little bit different. Sunny. Surf Strider. He's pretty cool. That was an unlockable skin. Thunder. Needs more detail. The Inquisitor. Now, you're supposed to be like a squid person. I like the hair color. That's nice, but it doesn't look very squid person-y here. Still pretty. Oh, I like the, the hair color a lot. Wow, so so shiny. The Herald. Now, you should be a little more plant-like, but still pretty cool. Nice. The Burning Wolf. He was, I think, one of Midas's uh, first recruits. Tarana needs more. I think Tarana is supposed to have a bunch of tattoos. Sylvie. T and Tina. This is cute. But she doesn't have a lot of her TNT iconography, but I guess that's okay. Tuna fish. Now, you need to be fixed because you are not fish. Clearly, you're supposed to be like a fish stick, and you're not a fish stick. Man, you and Meow Skulls and Kit should, should form a club. Trace. Tracy Trouble. That's a, I think that was a crew pack skin. Triarch Aurora. That was a level up pack. She looks pretty cool. Triarch Knox. Needs some work. Belle Berry. She's pretty cute, but she doesn't have her berries on her. That's too bad. And then Arctic Adelin. Zig. Now you're supposed to be an alien, so clearly they're, they're going to fix that. Xander. Also, you're supposed to have some more printing and stuff. They're going to fix that. Vicora. Level up uh, quest pack. Suki 2.0. Nice. The printing is pretty great on her. She has like a special scene as well. Like some of them have a special scene. Meow Souls has one too. Like Blizzabelle, crew pack skin. Cade. Chrome Punk. Now you let you look less he's a, he's got like a pumpkin head in the in game, so they're probably gonna change that. Clip. The clip is from Save the World, but she has a tool belt, and here she doesn't have her tool belt. That's too bad. Combat tech jewels again. Again, she should have her uh, her her tattoos and everything, and they're not showing that, so they're going to probably make these a little more in line. But Cutie Pie gets the mask? What? Hmm. Okay, who else do we have? We're getting near the end, I think. Gold-Blooded Ace. Frost Squad. Focus is a nice skin. I forgot that I bought that. Fastball, nice and orange. Still, my favorite color. Eternal Wanderer. Again, we talked about the astronauts not having their helmets. Where's your helmet? How come your, your hair's not all, all glowy? They're going to fix it, though, I think. Envision. Guff Gringle. Now, this, this you're supposed to look like a Christmas guff, and you don't look guffy at all. So they're going to fix that. You got Haxasaur, and you are a dinosaur, like a tech dinosaur. Where's your dinosaur head? So they're going to do that. They're going to fix that. Journey versus Hazard. Crit, uh... Chrisabelle, she looks pretty cool. But Major Mancake, Major Mancake has his pancakes, but regular Mancake doesn't. What? What's the deal with that? <laughs> Look at that though. He looks so tasty. Medley, Tart Tycoon, Special Forces, Snowbell, nice, Christmassy. Sled Ready Guff, again, another Guff uh, skin that needs to be fixed. Remedy versus Toxin. 
Penny. The order, you look pretty good for the seven. Yeah, nice printing. Turk versus Riptide from Chapter 2, Season 1. Underworld Desdemona. Nice. Volpez. Again, now you're a fox, so you got to get fixed. And Winter Wonderland Sky. Again, another sky that needs to be addressed because she doesn't look like sky. Although, I like the... the I think she needs her hat and everything. But Wooly, Wooly Warrior has the, the mammoth head. Nice. Dummy Supreme needs to be a dummy. Championship Jonesy, Championship Aura, Boxy, Zoe, Boxy's gonna get fixed to look like, probably like boxes, I'm pretty sure, because you're supposed to be wearing boxes. Zoe Clash, Zadie, hey, it's my daughter's name. She's got her eyes on you. She looks pretty good. FNCS Champion Seeker, I'm gonna take a picture of that for my daughter. She's gonna think that's hilarious. FNCS Champion Seeker, and then we've got FNCS Renegade. Jones Unchained. Looking pretty good, Jonesy. Looking pretty good. Miss Bunny Penny. you think they would fix it to give her like a bunny head, but no. And a tool belt. Recon Champion. Sergeant Sigil. Needs to be able to wear your banner, I think. And then Skull Scout. Oh, Skull Scout looks awesome! Look at the skull bones on her arms. I love it. The champion. This is nice and orange. Very simple. Very understated. Very cool. And then it looks like all these icons and collab skins are locked. You know, we got Aquaman, Batman, all the DC skins. Some video game collabs. Some icon people. Kabi Lame is there. Uh, uh, it looks like um, Cypher PK. Some, some Marvel skins, like here's Jennifer Walters. She's the She-Hulk. Some of the the Spider-Man skins, not all of the Spider-Man skins, though. We had one that was clearly okay. I wonder how they decided that. Ahsoka. Hmm. My Hero Academy, all the anime skins. Tron, oh. But Tron has Lego sets, man. Tron has Lego sets. And uh, the Demogorgon, too, is a Lego minifigure. Well... I guess maybe time will tell if they they come through. So, and we'll have to wait and see Futurama. But there you go. I think overall, there's a lot of really awesome things to stand out here. Um, the Dark Vanguard is still my favorite, although I think there's a lot of really fun ones. Summer Sky is really well done. And I do like these two Galaxy skins, uh, Galaxia and uh, Galaxy Scout. I think they did a really great job uh, with these two skins in particular for the spacey ones, since it's really hard to make that translucent uh, see-through effect, that galaxy effect come through. But I think these two ones really hit the nail on the head. So I can't wait to go into LEGO Fortnite and check it out. But what do you all think? What Do you have a favorite LEGO skin that you're gonna be rocking in LEGO Fortnite? Is it one of the Star Wars or Marvel skins? Or is it one of these original ones that did carry through from your locker? Uh, let me know in the comments below. And thank you for watching. And uh, if you like this video, do like this video, and I will see you all in Lego Fortnite. So do stay safe out there. There's wolves and monsters, and don't get <laughs> don't get lost in space. See you then.